Hey, what's up guys? So in today's video, I decided to test how the Pack 5 Familiar works. So what I did with my friend Smelly Dogs is we did a baseline where I put 4,000 uh, inf, 5,000 uh, range, and 5,000 cav units. I'm in inf uh, phalanx, I believe. Yes, inf phalanx. So that uh, uh, Smelly Dogs is going to hit my inf. I'm asking to send 2,000 T2 inf as a baseline test without any familiars, and then he's gonna he's gonna go again, and then he's gonna add his Bon Appetit Pack Five familiar, so that we can showcase what happens with the back line uh, because we have more troops in the back line. So I'm gonna add some more troops for the second attack. Uh, there he goes. He attacks me. Um, we're gonna go see that report. Uh, obviously, it's a, it's a victory. So I he he, he gives me about 148 uh, losses. Thanks for the kills, <laughs> but that's the baseline. So I told him, you're just gonna lose about 6,000. In fact, he lost a little bit more because we messed up. All right, the second one, what I did is I did the same camp again, uh, and I put this time one more uh, range unit so that is pack five. Uh, will hit my largest squad, which is range. Um, but I made a mistake, so I should have added like four units. You're gonna see why, because when I do the cav one, you're gonna see what happened. But uh, for this one, uh, I know it's gonna it's gonna hit ranged. Um, but there we go. He's gonna attack me, and we're gonna see the difference. What happens with the uh, the Bon Appetit? The Bon Appetit is gonna proc. And it's gonna proc against my largest, um, my largest squad, which in that case is range, because I have one more troop than Cav. But <laughs> we will see what happens next. So obviously, uh, with the pack five familiar, what you're gonna notice, so we get 81 to the range units, but also the uh, T, uh, the inf also get more kills. Uh, which I'm guessing has to do with the familiarity uh, attack bonus and has to do with the fact that they kill those 81 troops so they deal less damage he was able to fight a little bit more so that's why there's a 20 troop difference in the kills of the, the front line also now on this on the third test I put 5001 cav units and you're gonna notice something special that I did not notice I had to re-record uh, but I just want to show you how the um, <laughs> this also a rally going going on um and there we go he is going to spy going to launch again and obviously just making sure that the fury is refreshed and all that stuff um making sure i did not mess up uh he's gonna send again and <laughs> the first thing that i'm gonna do is i'm gonna look at the report i'm gonna say okay there's no difference <laughs> but you're gonna notice it if you pause the video all right he attacked uh, I pull back, I get the reports, and I see, okay, it's the main, not the same number of troops. And as you can see, 249, 249, so I say, okay, uh, it proves is it. <laughs> I go in the report, and I don't notice <laughs> the pack 5 did not hit my cav, uh, because I did not send a full, um, a full extra squad. So what we're gonna do is we're going again. So this time I put 5,004 uh, 5, just to make sure there's one more units per squad. And you're gonna notice the difference. So we do another test basically against range. Uh, basically we're gonna get, get the same result, but I just wanna show that uh, we're gonna get the, the same result with 5,000 and 5,004. The familiar is gonna hit. It's, it, we're gonna get the same number of kills and losses and there we goes he's going to yeah he doesn't spy this time around he trusts me <laughs> so he attacks let's go and see uh we're gonna see that same uh, report 249 so okay and then uh i'm gonna do the same thing again uh this time again this time i'm gonna put 5004 for the cab units and this time the Bon Appetit will proc against Cav instead of range. So the, the full one more troop per squad really made clear that the one of the largest squad, the four largest squad were Cav instead of in the other way around. There was one squad that was range and then a, a couple more. Um, well, five, 5,001, one squad was Cav and the other one were a mix. 
so there we go he attacked me and then we're gonna see the difference a little bit less skills um, so 75 instead of 81 so there's the difference with that is gonna be with the stats and I'm gonna show my stats at the end uh, I had so there's a 6% difference in kills and we're gonna notice that there's the 13% difference between uh, Cav HP and range HP. When you uh, when you put that over two hundred percent, that's basically six seven percent. So that is the difference. There is no really counter effect. So the fact that I uh, the fact that is pack five is uh, infantry base and my uh, Cav units um, are obviously Cav. So there is no counter effect. Same thing with the range when uh, the infantry. Um, the, the infantry pack five or, uh, attack, my range, there is no counter effect. So it's really pure damage. Really the difference is, is gonna be your stats, your defensive stats. So defense and mostly HP. So in that case, like I showed, I had better cav stats. So that's why I got a better result. It has nothing to do with uh, countering, um, countering uh, counter stats as well as just the counter uh, rock paper scissor aspect of inf versus uh, range and then range versus cav and then cav versus infantry so basically guys let me know in the comments below if this is news to you i have looked in in youtube i have looked at i've tried to find some guides regarding this concept and i was not able to find it so that's why i decided to do the test so if you knew about it already, let me know down below. If you didn't know, well, <laughs> hopefully you guys learned something new today. All right, guys, that's going to be it for this video. I'll see you later.